Hi, this is Troy Rank for Denver 7, and the legal tampering period of free agency begins on Monday. Teams can officially sign players to contracts Wednesday at 2 p.m., but the Broncos free agency, they don't expect to make big splashes, but they have work to do. One of those positions where they need improvement, the quarterback room. They need to add improvement, an upgrade, and competition for Drew Locke at the very least. Now listen, Deshaun Watson is the pipe dream, but as of now, Houston says he's not available in a trade. They may hold on to him. They may hold on to him all the way until the draft. Well, the Broncos can't wait that long to get somebody to challenge Drew Locke. They could throw this person overboard or Locke, but they got to get something done before the draft starts. And that list looks like this. Let's start with Andy Dalton. He was 4-5 and five with the Cowboys last year, three-time Pro Bowler, been to the playoffs. He's the kind of guy you can win games with. You could likely get him on a reasonable deal, two-year, 14, two-year, 15 million that you could move on for after one year. Mitch Trubisky, we've talked about him from the Bears. George Payton, I look for him to trend younger in free agency. Trubisky's only three years older than Drew Locke. He would be a rebound candidate. Obviously, the Bears don't want him back. That's a red flag because they need a quarterback. But he was 5-2 and two against Peyton's Vikings. He knows Vic Fangio. Maybe in a new system, out of Chicago, you can find some value for him. Remember, in the case of Luck, sometimes you just need a reliever to come in or someone to play in case of injury since he's been injured his first two seasons. That's where someone like Ryan Fitzpatrick comes in. He was the best reliever in football last year. No one's going to ever forget that Vegas Raiders game where he came in and won that for the Dolphins. He nearly did that against the Broncos. Now, could you get him for one year, $8 million? Maybe not. The former Harvard grab, it feels like he has stayed, played with every team in the NFL. But he might want two years. He played well enough to start in this league this season, but he would be an ideal mentor for Drew Locke and just someone to have that veteran presence in the quarterback room. Finally, Teddy Bridgewater. I like Teddy the person, the way he competes, the character, but the reality is he is a higher-priced Case Keenum. He would make $17 million this upcoming season. If the Broncos were to trade for him, you'd have to reduce that salary. I just don't see the upside for him. 15 touchdowns, 11 picks. It's just, for me, not enough better than uh, Drew Locke. Alex Smith's one to keep an eye on. I think Jacksonville makes the most sense for him. And Sam Darnold, again, is not someone the Broncos have shown interest in thus far this offseason. For Denver 7, I'm Troy Rimp.